Meantime, Yale students are on a mission to make a match for those in need of bone marrow donors. Yeah, they set a goal to register 1,000 students today at the annual Mandy Schwartz Marrow Donor Registration. NBC Connect's Kyle Jones joins us live there now. Kyle, this has become a tradition at Yale, hasn't it? Yeah, Kevin, they've done this for 16 years, and as you said, they set a goal of uh, registering 1,000 students, and every year they set that goal. This year, they say that they're close to 600, which is a good number for them, and the students have put out their best effort making the pitch all day long. Have you guys signed up for the Mandy Schwartz Registry? One by one. Okay, we're here till 5 p.m. today. It just takes about uh, three minutes of your day to save a life. Yale student athletes were relentless. Are you heading over to the blue tent to sign up for the Mandy Schwartz Registry? Uh, yes. Awesome. So it takes about three minutes of your day. And getting fellow students signed up at the annual Mandy Schwartz Marrow Donor Registration Drive. Okay, so there's a QR code right there. It's going to take you to a site. You're just going to scroll down to the bottom and fill out a couple questions. Like these students signing up here today, Johnny Aw put his name on the list two years ago as a freshman on the crew team. Last fall, I got a call uh, that I was a potential match, so I went through the protocol and donated at the end of January this year. Hopefully saving the life of a woman he doesn't even know. I think that it was such an easy process for me that it didn't really seem like I did anything that big. He went through NMDP, the National Marrow Donor Program, that's on campus today in partnership with the Mandy Schwartz Bone Marrow Foundation. Ann Evans says that they need young people on the national registry. Right now, 80% of donors are between the ages of 18 to 35. So that's why it's critical to get people on as early as we can, close to age 18, because they're the people that are providing the best uh, chance for a patient. And they need diversity. There aren't actually many Asian people of Asian descent that sign up to be on the registry. So Asian people who end up having to get transplants end up having a harder time finding a donor. The world is not just one type of race. It's a lot of different races. It's a lot of different people. Um, and I think having more and more people sign up from whatever background, I think is a very good thing. So Mandy Schwartz was a women's ice hockey star here who died from leukemia back in 2011. And so over those 16 years that they've registered students here on campus, they've registered thousands. And 96 students have been matches for people helping to save their life. There's three juniors on campus right now that have done just that. So they hope to get four more people somewhere in the mix to save a life sometime soon. Live in New Haven, I'm Kyle Jones, NBC Connecticut News. Guys, back to you.